We're taking a live look from our Hyatt South Park camera, a view toward South Park Mall, the scene of an armed robbery that many people have not been uh, that realized was even happening. As Queen City News anchor Derek Dellinger found out today, that robbery wasn't over money, but kids' clothes. What happened here at South Park Mall likely happened under a lot of people's noses. But on Friday, police say two people were trying to take children's clothes, and when an employee approached them, they showed a gun. The robbery itself is not that unusual, but the fact that it involved children's clothes and a gun is what caught the attention of one security consultant we spoke with, who told us those pieces of clothing don't always have security tags on them, and they can be easily resold online. There is an acknowledgement here that this could have ended very differently, and the fact that this was over kids' clothes should not surprise anyone. There's a lot of people out there with goodwill in their hearts wanting to stop yeah. crime when they can. They don't understand now that it's being escalated. The flash of the gun is definitely an escalation. That's a deadly event at that point. Yeah. Uh, and they're not trained for that, and they're certainly not armed for it. What happened here on Friday is not a singular occurrence. In fact, there's a wide range of incidents that have happened over the last six months here at South Park Mall. We'll take a closer look at them and what's being done about them coming up at 5. In South Park, Derek Dellinger, Queen City News.